Yo, what's up guys, it's new here and welcome back to a brand new video. So today I'm going to be teaching you guys how you can make a floating border thumbnail effect on your Android device. This effect is actually pretty dope and popular and I think it's such a cool way to make your thumbnails look interesting and i made this thumbnail right over here and on this video you guys spammed in the comments that i should make a tutorial on this so here is the tutorial and without being sad let's get going Okay, so for this video, I'm going to be using Photoshop Touch, obviously. So if you guys don't have Photoshop Touch, I will leave a link in the description below. You can go ahead and get it and install it. So as you can see right over here, I have already imported one of my old thumbnails right over here. And we are going to be applying the border effect into this. So first thing, go ahead and use the marquee selection tool, which is this rectangle right over here. And press on this button until it says plus. So you need the plus mode right over here once that done go ahead and just select the borders of this thumbnail as easy as this so let's go ahead and just select the right one and once that done go ahead and go to the bottom one and i think this is actually the easiest part about this video you can go ahead and just pretty much you know select the borders and that's it so once you're done selecting the borders go ahead and press on this button right over here and then you should uh, see this plus button hit on it and press on layer from selection and what we did we just basically separated separated the uh, border from the thumbnail so now we have a border to work with so in order to make this border right over here look like that it's floating uh, above the actual thumbnail all you have to do is to go ahead and just add a drop shadow effect into it and i like to make the distance zero and just you know uh, mess around with the blur you can go ahead and uh, add another blur if you want to and just decrease the uh, insanity and do whatever you guys want with it and yeah you can actually go and just use whatever you want uh, of effects into this border and what I like to do I like to go ahead and just mess around with the blending option my favorite one is multiply but it really depends on the colors of the thumbnail but multiply makes the thumbnail or the border look more contrasty and yeah guys this is the effect it's as easy as that you can actually go ahead and apply this into any kind of thumbnail you have and it adds this dramatic look to the thumbnail and you know it makes it more interesting for the viewers so they will click on your video and you will get more views and i think we are ready to wrap up today's video i know pretty short one but i think you guys will love it certainly because this is such a popular effect and i know you guys will love this one so yeah guys thank you guys so much for watching this video if you enjoyed this video or you found it helpful please go ahead and like this video and subscribe to my youtube channel thank you guys so much for watching and i catch you guys later peace out